Hi everyone. The ship was named after Philip V of Spain, the first Bourbon ruler of Spain, who in the War of the Spanish Succession managed to defend his throne against the claims of the Austrian Habsburgs. The ship was built by Cyprian Otron and Pedro Boyer using the system and the new design specifications of Antonio de Gaztaneta. Launched in 1690, San Felipe was one of Spain's most majestic fighting ships of the 17th century. This three-decker was a giant of 1965 tons that could take up to 114 cannon. At that time only the French Faudroyant was larger. She possessed a slim profile and wide spread of sails which bestowed great maneuverability and agility. Her beauty was enhanced by a variety of beautiful sculptures which adorned her stern transom. San Felipe was an integral part of the great Spanish fleet when it was engaged in perennial wars against both Britain and France over dominance of territories in the Caribbean and South America. Her role was to protect Spanish settlements and harbors, transport treasure back to Spain, safeguard other vessels on their passages back to Cadiz and other Spanish ports. The San Felipe proved to be a firm vessel of great firepower. She could repulse all attacks and fought like hell, according to English sources. In 1705, she participated in a furious battle involving a total of 12 Spanish and 35 English ships. After a 24-hour battle, she was captured by the English ship. Too badly damaged, San Felipe could not be salvaged as a prize of war and sank with several tons of gold and other treasures still on board. The San Felipe is supposed to be the largest and most beautiful ship of the Spanish fleet at that time. Strangely, despite of that there is no proven contemporary illustration of her. In books, articles or internet one can find many depictions, but they are all different and none of them is contemporary. José Ignacio González Alejero, the former curator of the Museo Naval in Madrid, provided some information. He has published several books about the Spanish fleet, and about the inventory of the Museo Naval. In his publications Novio Real Felipe and El Novio Estatre Puntes en la Armada Española he in detail outlined the history of the ship. Sail for old England. 
Thanks for watching.